Hello, future heroes, and welcome to another episode of the My Hero Academia Weekly Hero Challenge. Last week, though they were unable to prevent Bakugo's kidnapping by the villainous Vanguard Action Squad, Kirishima and Todoroki realized that they had a second chance to help him when they overheard Yaoyorozu telling All Might about the tracker she'd placed inside of the Nomu. So we asked you guys to tell us about times when you personally found second chances to prove yourself or do right by others. Here are the results. Hit it, man! This could not have come at a better time, it seems, for our dear friend and beloved Hyperforce Red Ranger, Peter Sodarso, who actually lived this challenge this week when he was given more time to prepare for what he described as the worst audition of his life. We love you, Peter, but we're gonna give this one to a wonderful member of the Hyperforce and, frankly, all the Hyper RPG community, at Kuki Arbot. Your recognition of how hard your tutor worked to get you another chance at higher education and your resolve to show your appreciation by not letting her down perfectly captures what the spirit of Second Chances is about. And now it's time for this week's challenge. In My Hero Academia Season 3, Episode 8, From Ida to Midoriya, Midoriya is faced with the choice of either joining Todoroki and Kirishima in their ill-advised quest to rescue Bakugo, or supporting Ida and stopping them. Yaoyorozu also must decide whether or not to generate a second receiver to track down the Nomu and discover the location of the villain's hideout. As expected, after he is discharged from the hospital, Midoriya lies to his mother, telling her that he has to stay another night, and instead meets up with Kirishima and Todoroki with the intent of going to rescue Bakugo. Yayorozu arrives with him, but before she can reveal what she's decided, they are interrupted by the arrival of Ida, who pleads with them to consider the repercussions, not only to themselves, but to Yue as a whole, before taking action. As Ida expresses his fears to Midoriya, afraid that this time he will push himself too far and end up like his brother Tensei, Todoroki and Kirishima reveal that they have no intention of facing the villains head on. In order to technically follow the rule that prohibits miners from using their quirks to fight outside of school, they plan to sneak into the villains hideout and extricate Bakugo without actually fighting. Yaoyorozu agrees to help them and decides to accompany them to ensure they don't cross the line and Ida follows suit. As the team travels to the location revealed by Yaoyorozu's receiver, Todoroki takes a moment to remind everyone that what they're about to do is selfish and that no one asked them to do it. When Midoriya considers whether or not to turn back, he is reminded of All Might's words. Meddling when you don't need to is the essence of being a hero. Yes. Since he received both his powers and inspiration to be a hero from All Might, Midoriya knows he cannot turn back when he has a chance to reach his kidnapped friend. Then there's like a really great sequence of the team arriving in Comedy Award and like going on a shopping spree to get adult disguises it's and there's good. not much to it besides some hilarious costumes and a basic lesson in economics, you know, courtesy of Yaoi Rozu, of course. This week's challenge is, of course, one of making choices and taking actions that you certainly weren't asked, but weren't strictly forbidden to do. We want to know about times in your life when you got involved that something that maybe wasn't your problem to fix, but made a difference with your actions. It could be something small, like taking the initiative to get the refrigerator at work cleaned out every week, even though you always buy your lunch, or big, like helping spearhead an HR case against a coworker who isn't bothering you specifically, but you know is harassing your colleagues. Yeah. As always, use that hashtag MHA Hero Challenge when sharing your stories on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, or in the comments below. Everyone who submits will get a chance to be featured on our show and win prizes thanks to our friends at Funimation. Get your submissions in by 3 p.m. Eastern New Pacific on Tuesday, June 5th. Also, if you guys are looking for more anime content here on Hyper RPG, be sure to check out our series Hyper Otaku Presents Anime Club, where we're currently discussing the Tenchi Muyo OVA series. This week's episode covers episodes 8 through 13, which is the second OVA. Follow the link in the description and let us know what you think. Also remember, if you're subscribed to Hyper RPG on Twitch, you can check out the VOD of our My Hero Academia RPG, GM'd by yours truly. Ooh. And be sure to tune in again next week for more My Hero Academia and another episode of the My Hero Academia Hero Challenge. Go Beyond Plus Ultra! Hey guys, be sure to check out new episodes of My Hero Academia every week on Funimation Now. Don't have a subscription? Then head over to Funimation.com slash subscribe and enter promo code HYPERMHA at checkout for $5 off your first month subscription. This code is a limited time offer and only available to the first 500 subscribers. So what are you waiting for? Yeah. Seriously, Funimation has one of the biggest anime streaming libraries on the internet and it's only $5.99 a month. So that means you can get your first month for only 99 cents and that's after a two week free trial? What? Come on guys, get on yeah, it. Yeah, it's really a no brainer. Go subscribe. Yeah.